Hello again, friends, family, fans, freaks, and fiends. This is the weather report, and long overdue, I know, and stormy here. So, I had meant to do this earlier this week, but it seems like every day in the past several days in a row has been some kind of news. Good and bad and all over the place, so... Uh, I'm going to start with some good, just starting today, that we met our goal with the billion mechs here. I don't know if it'll let me take a look at it, but uh, let's see if this shows anything. I hate that this loads so slowly. All right, well, there's the congratulations message. So I don't remember what the prizes for... Uh, for getting this uh, was to be, but uh, I am happy that you know, hundred grand's going to a charity, uh, able gamers. So, you know, good on them. Uh, also, since the last time I did one of these, uh, I think Missile Rack Twelve had just come out. Uh, I have not shot any video on that. M other than with uh, Kill Shot, which uh, I definitely love. I haven't tried it on any other uh, medium mechs, but definitely works very well with Kill Shot. And uh, also, the Javelin 8s have come out, and Stasis Beam 8s, too. Uh, most everybody has access to the Javelin 8s. I like them. Uh, I haven't been running them too much lately because I'm trying to work now on some more achievements I haven't been, uh, well, working on in a while. And then the Stasis Beam 8s, honestly, if you're at the same place I'm at in game, don't even bother. It is not worthwhile. Now, if you're early, maybe mid game, want to try something new, have at it. Um, yeah. So, the only other thing left to kind of cover is that uh, there was an announcement for pilots. And I was going to make a video as soon as I found out about it. I was pretty upset about it. Um, now, I'm not a content creator or part of the partners program or anything. I'm just a player, just shooting you know, YouTube videos. Just this is my opinion. And I know when this survey came out, um, however long ago it was, I did not support the idea of having pilots come to the game. I still feel more that way now, but it seems that it's going to happen. There's going to be one freebie. It, it just gives me flashbacks of War Robots, and I really hope... Mech Arena does something to improve that. So just real cautiously going to see how they go about doing this. And of course, I'm going to cover it when it does happen. I have a feeling it's going to be sooner rather than later, maybe within a week. I, I really don't know. I haven't heard anything, but the way the announcement's gone and everything, it sounds like they're really pushing for it. And I was really hoping for Disc Launcher 12s to be coming out soon. Um, and then here I find out also the second season of the Battle Pass is going to be happening very soon. Uh, season one's about to end today. Or, okay, tomorrow. And then whatever season two is. I forget what's going to be offered. I assume it's going to be a bunch of skins and some credits and maybe a couple other things. So, yeah. Um, yeah, I'm not too happy about that. Um, though I kind of hope that uh you know works out for the best so all right now on to some better stuff i like the hanger that i got right here just everything kind of looks like they go together all the mechs just the similar skins they all look this kind of futuristic cyclops kind of look and everything is meant for uh achievements and i've been playing mostly 5v5 uh to help along with that in fact i'm almost done with the um uh, well, I'll just show you. Brickhouse. Uh, his uh, one with the uh, plasma cannon. I'm a little less than... Four, almost 3.3 3 million 
in damage to go, and I've been averaging when I've been able to get them out on a map that works with them, get about a hundred thousand damage, so like every tenth of a million there. So, in 33 games or less, I should have it accomplished. So, in the next maybe tomorrow, I mean, I'll, I'll play a little bit more today with it and maybe finish it up tomorrow. I'm not gonna just gung ho for 30 something matches, but uh, yeah, once I get that done, I'm probably gonna swap back again, uh, Cheetah. Because was really working with Brickhouse trying to get those, uh, help, help do my part with get those billion kills. So I'll put the cheetah back in, and I was doing some experiment experimentation with cheetah with the uh, stasis beam eights, thinking that would be a pretty good uh, support weapon, and it's really not. Um, I was having better luck with the uh, stasis beam twelve paired with the uh, thermal lance four, and more damage was taken off, and it was working well. So. But uh, I'll save that for another time. Um, yeah. So uh, maybe I should just get into a little 5v5 and uh, see how it goes. Now, and another reason I like the 5v5 is, one, you don't have to worry about the uh, beacons when you're focusing on certain things. And... Um, gives you practice for tournament matches and it still could be random I still could have a full squad coming against me or just one player or all AI and you know I just gotta make the necessary adjustments so all right looks like nobody I recognize all AI just me so Let's start kill shot get an early lead see if I can get a First blood, and um, go from there. Oh, that was a little too quick. No, I'm not gonna get that first blood now. Yeah, something else is gonna do it. But I can help with this. A double, almost a triple. Double works, but I don't think there's any uh, achievements. For getting a double kill with a uh, kill shot. And also here with the season pass, the shotgun eight is going to be coming out, which will help with one of uh, kill shots achievements in that beacon protector one. I hope it's worthwhile. Um, and also, you know, help with uh, cheetah as well. I really hope they kind of do the same thing with the auto cannon. Oh, shoot, that's why I can't talk and play at the same time. I can't pay attention to what's going on. Um, yeah, I think that'd be a good idea having some like up souped up versions of the older weapons. And auto cannon and uh, I'm trying to think what else would be good. And shotgun eight sounds great. So this is essentially how you do is well if I didn't kill that guy, but try and get damage with the uh pulse cannon. It's strong. It's just this weapon's weapon is just not that strong at all. Definitely not good in competitive play. I, I try not to have this guy out whenever uh squatting out with anybody or just try not to use it at all so the kill shot here is pretty solid I'm liking this and ooh, not be that close to me right now well now I got a first blood a little bit helps Next, well, it's not a good spot to hang out. If I can splash. All right, my guy's gonna get taken. Well, got a good lead. I can probably afford to be a little, uh, a little more aggressive and let out my uh, brick house. Oh come on! Oh, 
Uh, wow. All right, let's just go for it. Just sacrifice him. Or I'm just gonna run into you. All right. I think 30 seconds is enough to get a little brick house action. Back up, I think other next are gonna keep flanking me. I didn't kill that guy, did oh, I? did. Okay. Probably not gonna finish him. Alright. Well, like I said, that's work in progress. So, until, uh, a new weapon, a new mech, or pilots, I guess, come out. This is kind of what I'm going to be doing for a little while. Just trying to close out the uh, some achievements that I've been working on for a good long while. So let's just double check how much I did on that. I feel like I got at least a tenth of a million on that. Yeah, that's it. So it was 43.7. So yeah. And then you know, with all my other... Next, it's something else. First blood for kill shot. I'm still trying to get the. Um, well, I'll just do it this way. Lost a guardian. Long shot. Got under 100 to go. Panther. Just his beams. Which really, I just need to just make contact with uh, as many mechs as I can. It's icebreaker. So, I mean, I still got. Several hundred to go on that. About 600 ish? Yeah, about right. And then, uh, I'm really liking Surge on um, two arches and Agora with those uh, rocket mortars because it doesn't have to be at any particular uh, distance. It's just get the kills. So it's pretty easy when you don't have to worry about how far away you know the enemies are. So. All right, uh, so I'm probably just going to wrap it up here. I'm, I intend on making another uh, Max Hang running your Max Hanger video in the next couple days. And, uh, yeah, whenever something else new comes out, I'll be back here. So, yeah, just wanted to kind of put something out there. You know, there's some good and some bad and some not so sure what's going to happen. So... All right, well, hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you haven't already, and subscribe if you haven't already, and tell a friend, and leave a comment, and let me know what you think on things that are going on right now and in the near future. So we'll see you again next time. Bye.